Since the pot broth, it actually makes this in two hours, but because I started it last night before we went to bed, it made it and then conveniently kept it warm. I like that. Add double oil, iron, zero, rosemary, what? Then pepper, better we go. Lily, you, mince, you uh, peel the garlic, then we're gonna mince it, don't cut it. Let's uh, cut the onions. Oh, you might not want that job. Go ahead and stir those, Gideon, in the avocado oil, okay? Five minutes. The Instapot is nice on the farm because you could still celebrate meals, make nice meals in it, but pretty much you just set it up and then get it out. So it does most of the work for you. If you're interested in that, I'll leave the link down in the description to the one we've got. Oh my word, hash. You guys liking the hash? Mm -hmm. Is this a celebrative morning or what, Mom? It is. It's delicious. It's all good. One, two, three, four poles right over there. And maybe four more over there, maybe 10, just to be sure. I finally busted. Boy, this thing's been a trooper. All of the farm tour and a little bit of this farm work busted the lens. Oh, filming on the old point and shoot, the G7X. Good backup camera. Let's feed uh, stud muffin. That's one cool thing about having a lensed camera. The lens is just most likely to break and not the whole camera. So if something were to go wrong on this little G7X, one thing, the whole thing's shot. Here you go, stud muffin. How you doing, buddy? I do have news for you, Stud Muffin. The cow's coming. Your buddy's coming. We got word from the sellers. Thursday or Friday. I know. We hope to have you only in here a couple of days. You don't seem terribly unhappy about it. You got a good light. You got great hay. And give me a second, I'll give you some more water. Thank you very much. Back up. Ah, there we go. You want to always be very careful with a bull, no matter what. Been around uh, cows my entire life. You never want to put your back up to one. And when we're out in the field, we're going to always carry a staff just in case. And of course, we're never going to let the kids near them. Uh, by themselves. The American Milking Devon is generally a very docile breed. We've had great experience with those bulls in the past. Uh, but you just never can be too careful. Let's have another go getting our post. We just need a pin or so. We have about 187 of Another way to say stay safe around the bull is I've been reiterating it day after day here lately, is always give them something when, when you're around so you are associated with something good. Uh, right now it's giving him hay and water out in the field. It'll be moving him to new grass. It'll be filling up his water, those kinds of things. Another way to keep safe, I've kind of been reiterating it, is a partner for that bull. Somebody for him to hang out with, be distracted by, dare I say play with? 
bored to death in that stall and uh, looking for some action. The plan is give him a partner, also keep him busy, keeping him moving, fresh grass. Probably twice today, at least once a day. You know, uh, get his attention off of me. Two more posts going in. I'd say one right there and then one down at the end. Another thing, you can look at a, a bull, just don't stare at him. And certainly, don't ever corner him. You don't want him to feel like he doesn't have an escape. That's why I'm even extra careful with him in the stall than I might be in the field because in the field he's got all this room and he feels like he can escape. So they would rather, they would rather flight than fight, I'm telling you. Now I'm getting my spool out. And we're gonna just put the wire up where we just did the poles and we'll call it a day. I finished putting those lines on. Now to the most important work I can think of. That would be special time just between my wife and I on a very special day date. Beauty and I had a good time on our date. Yet another meal out of the Instant Pot. Hey, did you guys do anything while I was gone? Did you guys film anything? Yeah. What was it? Christy um, playing her guitar. Enough dancing. Let's cut to you dancing and Christy playing the guitar. Okay, it's on. They're recording. <laughs> now let's see Woo. what this is. Woo! Lamb shanks. Can you say celebrate? Celebrate. Oh yeah, nice and tender. Oh yeah, falling off the bone. Think little Mr. Brown will like that one on the bone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, cool. Papa, I want Jumanji on the TV. Yeah? Yeah, you wanna know why? You would probably watch it. Yeah, I'd watch it every day. You would like it? Yeah. You liked it that much, huh? Yeah, I love it.